So here we've got Sullivan that's being fully gray traced with all his hairs. Um, and we're not doing some of the tricks that I'm going to be using with regards to hair by segmenting it into lots of linear segments. We're actually um, intersecting this implicitly, which means that we can go in close and the hair will keep this nice, smooth um, curvature. And as well as hair, we decided to tackle some of the more subtle things, such as subsurface scattering. So if you look at his horns and his eyes and his teeth, um, they're actually scattering light within that volume. So Alfonso's just kind of playing around with some of these uh, controls to see how the subsurface affects those particular aspects of the character. Yeah. Stanley also pointed out uh, having the possibility of changing this uh, as well as the glass and the people. Uh, changing subsurface in real time is a big achievement for lighter. Uh, this information from the Inocator and the render thing um, necessary to process this is huge. So for us, having the interactivity of playing with it is, is amazing. 